My name's Georgia Perch, I'm 26 and I am a centre back. And this season you're the new vice captain of the fleet. Um, you'll be working with Charlie Clifford, who's been named captain as well. How, how are the two of you gonna gonna work and, and be the leaders of the club this yeah, season? Yeah, I mean, yeah, very grateful to be vice captain for the upcoming season. Um, I've worked with Charlie before at Cholton, so um, I have played with her um, when I was a little bit younger. Um, so yeah, we've worked alongside each other, which has been really nice. So um, yeah, I mean, I look up to Charlie massively, so I think we'll work really well together. Um, so yeah. And you've been at the club since January, since your move. How has it been the last few months settling in here? Yeah, yeah so really, really, really good. Um, absolutely loved it. I think I sort of lost my love for football and um, came here and completely found it again. Um, love the girls, know a lot of the girls from previous um, clubs and yeah, made me feel so welcome. Um, and yeah, playing some of my best football again and yeah, just really enjoying it. So yeah, great facilities, great coaching staff and a great group of girls. So. And the, the upcoming season, there'll be some new teams in the division, some tough teams. Um, what, what do you think we can achieve this season? Yeah, I mean, I think we're all positive and we want to push for, obviously, top of the table finish. Um, we all want to sort of get promotion. That's always been our aim since I've come in. Q's always said that is our aim, promotion. Um, we've got a good group of girls as well with um, great abilities. Some who have played in the championship, some in tier three. Um, very, very strong squad and he has recru recruited over the summer as well. So. I have full hope that we can yeah, push on this season and hopefully get the promotion we deserve. Yeah, and you're an experienced player, you've played at high levels. Um, how, how's that experience going to be key coming into this season? Yeah, I think like a lot of the team here, a lot of the players I've played with before at previous clubs in higher divisions. Um, and I think, yeah, it does bring us as a club um, good experience going into obviously the season. Um, so, yeah. We've mentioned your experience just there. Um, how does it compare at the fleet compared to, to those at higher clubs, at higher levels that you've been with before? Yeah, so I think for me, dropping down from um, tier three to tier five was something that I didn't know if it was going to be right for me, was sort of considering it, didn't know what the quality was going to be like. Um, so I think for me, coming down and actually the quality not being much different from the team that I came from was actually really positive. And like I say, a lot of the girls I've played with before at previous clubs, and they are great players, they have great ability. Um, Fleet have a great setup, we've got a great stadium that we play at, we've got great training facilities, great team. Um, so I feel like the difference isn't, isn't that big, and I think that's, that's great for us and we're very lucky. And how's pre-season been? You've played a couple of higher tier clubs. Yeah. Um, how, how was that? Yeah, I mean, that? I think like we played Billericay the other day. Um, I think we held them to nil-nil the first half. Like that's pretty impressive considering that was our first game. Um, I think pre-season is all about getting fitness, getting the work in, match day um, fitness, game day fitness. You can't get that unless you're playing games. So I think that is our main aim with the pre-season fixtures. Um, but to show that we can compete still, we can score goals against tier three sides we can maintain a half at nil nil I think that's really positive but I think for us the main aim is to just get fitness match fit um, and that will come throughout our pre-season fixtures and through training yeah. and finally there's a few new players here this season um, how's the makeup of the squad from, from your view and how are they all settling in? Yeah, really good. I mean, we've kept a lot of the core team from last year, which is positive. Um, but Q has also brought in a couple of players, which is really, really nice. Had a couple of the under uh, 18 girls come up as well and um, they've been doing really, really well. So it's been really positive to see. Um, but yeah, a couple of familiar faces from um, some of the girls coming in. And yeah, it's looking really good. Looking like a strong team ahead of the season. So yeah.